welcome to my first ever vlog. I'm packed and ready to go to London Fashion Week. So um, I'm training it down to use in, in a short while um, and then I've just got a tube ride to my accommodation. I'm going down the night before just to make sure I'm ready because my first call time tomorrow is 9am. So rather than getting up at 4am and relying on trains and being on time etc, I thought I'd get a head start on it and just make sure that I'm ready and fresh for tomorrow. I've actually got three shows to do tomorrow so it's going to be a lot of running around, maybe a few Ubers in the middle of it but I'm sure it's going to be really exciting. I am really looking forward to it. I'm going to vlog the whole thing so you will hopefully get an insight into what actually goes on, what I do. Um, and yeah, just sort of travel around with me. So, hope you enjoy it. So, I'm at my accommodation. It's absolutely gorgeous outside, as you can probably see from the villas above me. The sun is streaming through. So, I've kind of had to strip off because it was about a 10 minute walk and yeah, the sun out, it's nice. So um, I'm in my room, I'm going to do a little bit of work, I've got the iPad out already and I'll catch up with you guys in the morning, it's going to be an early one, uh, I've got to be on set for about 9 o'clock so I'll probably get up there for quarter to 9, something like that, so another tube journey and find out where I've got to be etc, but otherwise I'll keep updating you because I've got three shows to do tomorrow, so going to be exciting, going to be a bit tight at times maybe, I'll keep you posted. So before it all gets too crazy, I thought I would take you through my session tech kit. This is the kit that I take to every show that I do, whether it's London Fashion Week or um, a catwalk show, some sort of trunk show or uh, maybe a magazine photo shoot. So you can see this is my entire kit that fits really, really nicely into this original sugar bag. Um, it's from mine and Sam's days a few years ago. Uh, but it's actually the perfect size bag, it fits everything that I need in it. So. I've got my baby wipes and some couch roll that I've laid flat. I've got nail wipes and I've got my little tool kit there with cuticle nippers and brushes for tidying up small lines, dotting tools, um, tweezers, things like that in there. Then I've got a couple of these towels which are really, really uh, good sized. They're like sort of um, a very small hand towel, they're bigger than a face cloth, probably twice the size of a face cloth. Then we get on to the steridant tube. <laughs> no, there's not actually steridant in there. That's my barbicide and it keeps it airtight, watertight, and nothing can get in or out. So I've got my pro pusher and cuticle tools in there. I've got here some acetone, some universal sanitizer so I can keep my files and um, everything else I'm using clean. A couple of white black buffers. I usually use Orly, I have done for years and years, so I'm not going to change now. So that's the kit that I'm taking with me. Uh, it fits nicely into this bag as you can see, I've got my files in there. I'm just going to tuck these bits in so you can see what's happening and the towels go on top. So it all fits quite nice and neatly in there and that's something I can carry around with me from model to model, wherever I need to be. Hi, so first off, excuse the way I look, hair's tied up, I'm actually in my pyjamas right now. So I was snuggled up in bed, it's nearly 10 o'clock, I was just watching a film and the PR company that I'm doing some of this work for actually contacted me and they've got a fourth show for me to do tomorrow. So I've got to do the three shows that I'm already booked for and then run to wherever the next show is. I don't even know the details yet, but straight from the third show to a new show, um, Ashley Williams. So I need to go and Google that one. Uh, anyway, um, should be interesting, four shows. So, we've been here since about 9 o'clock this morning, the Nika Panda show. We're in a warehouse in Covent Garden, uh, hair tied back, as you can see. Um, Nothing's getting in my way today, so, but you can see, look, we're in a warehouse and behind me here is the whole show. All of the teams are here, hair, makeup and nails. Got the nails team in the corner there. We're all 
on a break now because all of the models have actually been done. But that's the desk that we were given. And so we've been underneath the tables for most of the day so far. Uh, the models have all gone upstairs now, so they're just having their run through. So we can't do too much right now. But it's all go, so I'll catch you in a bit. Wake up at mine. Same question always. I'm getting tired. We could have breakfast, kind of your freckles, close to the west coast. How about that? Why don't we just get a place together? Mornings in our own. So much better Balconies and bathtubs What you want Why don't we just get a place together So sorry I didn't actually get much in the way of filming done at this venue. Uh, we were late getting there and then I had to leave for the next show as well but there's lots on social media. and I'm absolutely shattered. 
My feet hurt. <laughs> the soles of my feet are actually just burning now. Four shows, one day is hectic. It's a lot. But made it and it was, it was all pretty amazing that last show. Stayed to watch it at the end just because we heard. Um, it's pretty crazy. So I'll put some of the videos into the video uh, that I'm compiling so you can see some of the in-betweens and uh, I can't show you this Jaylo. Jaylo? Jaylo. Jaylo. Yeah, I'm trouble saying that one. I can't show you that show because I had to leave early just to get to the next one but um, I'll post what I can for you. Hi, morning. It's Saturday morning, 7am. I'm on my way to the tube, not gonna lie. I'm a bit tired. Um, got in about half past nine last night and my alarm went off at six. My feet hurt. They actually just hurt. It was a crazy day yesterday. Uh, just one show to do today with Robert. I'm really looking forward to this one, working with Robert. He's amazing to work with. So. I've been really looking forward to this one. We've got another one together as well on Tuesday. So that should be good. I'll keep you posted. It's all pretty calm backstage here. Morning, it's Sunday and I'm up and ready, it's 8am, I'm just about to leave now to go to the tube station but I've had to pack everything at the moment because I'm, uh, I'm moving so um, yeah I've got my bags packed, I'm ready, uh, Supriya Lily today, I think that's how you say it, I'm having a little bit of trouble with some of these names but um, yeah it should be a good one, uh, it's one I did in February as well, show that I did then and uh, yeah it was quite khaki and army inspired so I'm excited to see what this one's going to be like. in there mainly because the girls the models didn't actually start arriving until about an hour and a half before the show and we've got 13 girls to do hands and feet so it was a bit of a mad scramble once they did start arriving and I'm actually rocking double socks as well and as you can probably see it's really hot <laughs> it's a really lovely day so I'm sweltering but my feet feel a little bit more comfortable I must say. Uh, they've taken a bit of beating over the last few days. So they went with a nude kind of shade, uh, natural nails, but each pinky had 
a long tip on it with some bindi style uh, gems. So uh, yeah, it looked quite interesting. Um, the it was a presentation rather than a show this time as well, so couldn't really hang around or get into to seeing that one. So that'll go on for a couple of hours. Um, it's one till three, um, but hopefully we'll be able to pick something else up on social media. So I'm in the tube station. I've got to tell you, I wasn't concentrating. <laughs> I was listening to my music and I've missed my stuff. So I had to like sort of go around and get where well, I'm waiting for the train to go backwards now. So um, yeah. Cool. Oh.